and we're back with another episode of Let's Play PC Building Simulator. I'm your host, your RPG Guy, and wow, that didn't register right away. When the sun rose that morning, it felt like another day, but the, by the time it set, it would be I would be a different man. I took Sam's computer over to the eSports arena with my hard disk nestled in the drive bay. Ladral was there already, hooking up his rig. It was a beast of a machine, all shining chrome, with a slash of red neon down one side that echoed the scar on his own cheek. He glared at me over his monitor. He wanted to be playing against one of his pals, someone who would throw the game. Instead, he got me. I've got to give this guy some credit. He put up one hell of a fight. For the first half of the match, it was everything I could do just to stay in the game. He seemed to be one step ahead of me the whole way. I figured that was it. I was done. After everything I'd gone through, I was about five minutes away from just standing up and co conceding. But then I took a look at the computer on my desk, Sam's computer, and something just clicked. Next thing I knew, I was making the greatest comeback since Elvis. The crowd was on my side, and I had him on the ropes. I chanced, I chanced a look over my screen. He looked peeved, more than usual, I mean. I don't recall too much after that. The cheers, I remember. Bright light, someone shoved a trophy into my hands. Then I was adrift in the crowd. Back up on the stage, the draw faded into the background and disappeared. He was finished. A week later... I would release all the info I had on him and his cronies, and he got served a lifetime ban from competitive play. To be honest, I'm not sure if it was necessary. He wasn't coming back. He didn't have the guts. I was back in my office when Sam came by to collect her computer and to say thanks. With the draw gone, she finally felt safe, and everything that happened... After everything that happened, I can't say that I blame her. Before she left, she leaned in and said she had a surprise for me. I swallowed hard. She reached inside a big coat of hers. I couldn't believe my luck. Then she pulled out a new bottle of whiskey. Steve Shovel P.I. Kill me now. Kill me now. Um, I'm pretty sure I managed to break something. It's a bit of a mystery. Can you figure out what's going on? I get the BIOS with a really long Aramis every time I boot up. I've got to have it by tomorrow. Okay, so we don't know what's wrong with it, so we just accept. Ugh. Well, that's a lot of money, so... Okay, now it feels bad. Looking for to buy a new PC in terms of performance. I wanted to benchmark around 3930. Can you get it done by tomorrow? An AIO cool water cooler would give me some headroom for overclocking later on. Don't try to pass over to use parts. I want all new stuff. Intel components are meant to be the bomb. We accept because we have the Intel part for you, brother. Don't, don't. <laughs> um, 2250. So that's, and that, that, that 3D Mark score is a joke. Um, to a degree. CPUs twenty two sixty whoops it is in here somewhere okay so minus two sixty five minus three hundred because we know how much that motherboard costs so we're now at sixteen eighty five so the cooling needs to be liquid cooled. It doesn't say what will work on it, so I worry a little bit, but we'll just take this one. Boom. Minus 60. I believe we've done cooling on them, so I'm not hyper-concerned. We know the memory is 4100. Specifically that. Um, I mean, let's do storage first, actually. We'll do the Patriot for 110. Minus 110. Power supply. 1300 there is a 1400 out there but i don't think it's worth it yet um let me see actually um yeah there isn't a 1400 i guess okay i thought there was but no just another 1300 i guess okay whatever don't care uh and the case let's go with the antec for this one Boom. Minus 60. See, we can shove a bunch of fans in there. <laughs> so, there's that. Okay, now we have graphics called. And did we buy... Oh, we didn't buy memory yet, did we? No memory. So, we need to do that, too. So, we don't want to go too big. I, I, You know, I'm a big fan, guys, of those Founders Editions. Boom. Minus 870. Which leaves us $485 for memory. Which I am happy to say will be good enough. So two of these is three twenty. What's the third one gonna be? Four eighty. 
We're actually going to not put fans in this machine because we barely got everything to fit in there. So um, we have $5 left to spare. So let's just leave it as is. I'm happy with that. All right. Next one. Okay, now this is tricky here because it's all got to be the expensive brand. Can I trust you building me this computer? I got to go big custom water cool whole PC. I've got to have it in eight days too. Have you heard of EKWB? They're meant to be pretty good. Don't pass on any of these parts. So all he cares about is EKWB. Um, he doesn't care what else is really in there. So we're not going to go all out like we did with this rig because there's just no point. Um, but we do want to make sure he's got a coffee lake in there because that way we can upgrade it later to something better if he comes back which is probable and highly likely. So we'll put in, oh, this guy's only 250, so minus 250, motherboard, coffee lake. Uh, we want the better RAM speed, so boom, minus 155. So memory is at four thousand. We don't. We're not gonna go at least. We're probably not gonna go more than two sticks or one stick. So boom, minus two seventy. Uh no, we'll take a second one. Boom, minus two seventy. We gotta get a water cooled GPU anyway, so we're not gonna worry with about that. Get a scorch for one ten. Power supply. Boom, minus 100. And we'll, for the case, to keep it simple, we'll go with the Antec as well. Boom, minus 60. Now, we have 1785 bucks to burn on the liquid cooling stuff. Now, you might say, why didn't I spend more? But you might have forgotten that EKW stuff is not cheap at all. It's never cheap. Um, so, yeah, boom, minus 130. Reservoirs. There we go. Boom. Minus 220. CPU blocks. See, they're 300 bucks for their computer for these blocks. So I wasn't kidding. Um, boom. Minus another 300. Which only leaves us 1135 for the water cooled GPU. Which theoretically we could go for the big in here. Um, uh, so, boom, minus 1,005. That leaves us with $130 left over. So, I, I'm okay with that. So, that's all there. And, uh, was I gonna build something? We were talking about that, weren't we? Weren't we, last episode, possibly building another rig... Um, what case do I not like? I don't like these white cases. I don't. I just don't know why. I'm not a big fan of them, but I just am not. So let's get rid of this one. So what do we have that we're sitting on? We need a coffee lake, uh, motherboard. And yeah, we need a coffee lake motherboard. We have memory. We got video cards. We got storage. We've got power supplies. And we've got AK's fan. <laughs> Which, you know what? Let's put it in there. If there's room, we can put it in. If there is room, let's put it in. Shove it in there. Hard. Alright, I'm happy with that. Okay, so yeah, we're going to get uh, a motherboard. The uh, Oops. We're going to get that extra motherboard. The Coffee Lake one. Boom. I can live with that. Okay, so let's buy it all now. So who's the liquid cooled? It is Lloyd. Is the liquid cooled? Lloyd, yours can go here. And Numbnuts can go over here. Really quick. 
fit this in there. I doubt we can do dual cards, so but we will open both just in case. So this is not necessarily a bad computer, but it's not a good one. Uh, let's get rid of this 2400, because I have a feeling it's not going to be the best. Around! Like I said, though, it's about time we did something with this. So we've got a 3 gig, we've got this 1070, and really that's about it. Got this hunk of junk. May as well, I guess. Pro uh, cooler. We have so many of these damn things. Not sure how, but we do, and we can't fit another one in there. So let's put those screws back in. Storage. Uh, you. Anything else? Oh, power supply. Put in the crummiest one that we've got, which we have a 550. Yep. Now, this is a heap of crap, so I'm not that eager to do more than I have to. That, that quickly booted. That strangely booted. Do we glitch it? So this isn't going to be worth very much, but at least we get, we get it out of here. We'll be lucky if it's worth about 800 bucks. Okay, this dude wanted the water-cooled bullshit, so let's do his now. Power supply. The motherboard, he's got the regular one here. I remember this, if my memory serves me right, we gotta put the output on here for the liquid cooling. Let's get the rest of this done. You should have room for two sticks of memory, which were these 4,000s. All right. Water cooled. Ooh, I got one of those I need to burn. Too bad this guy was right on the numbers. We could have put that in there, but oh well. Uh, reservoir we know can fit there. And coolant. We're going to pipe it first. I'm going to do it this way. All right, let's get this back, put back together while it's filling. This one is done, son. But oh, wait a minute. What do we Oh yeah, wait. This was a 970. So the one that's coming in is even worse than that, right? It's a 960. Yep. So there's no point in sitting on this. We're going to have another crappy two crappy cards to put in one of these coming up, so it makes no sense to sit on it. <coughs> 69 694. That's not that bad. It's not great, but it'll do. Now, before we do anything more here, we can actually put some more fans in here. 
So that's broken. That's used. Get one more fan in there. 190 remaining. What am I? Oh, uh, storage. What am I missing? Just gotta run that. Yeah, he wanted AIO cooling, which we can put, I believe, right up top. And now we can get rid of this sucker. Processor. Oh, it has to go on the front. Okay, that's fine. Don't care that much. Just to get that out would be great. Big old founders. Forgot. There we go. With five dollars remaining. Should make them nice and happy. So they could be happy. Well, wouldn't it be nice? <coughs> Seventy-eight, nineteen. Let that run. Should be fine. And it is. The new colored coolant. Yay. And we're just waiting for that to finish. And we'll be good. So we're doing really good here. I don't know if we're going to hit 26 with this one computer, but... We will with the computer. We got to diagnose on the next day. So we will be hitting 26 before this episode's over. Unless we get like 10 computers we suddenly have to build. Which don't leave it to this game to do that. It might actually act. You, you, you'd be surprised what it might pull on you. And we haven't used one of those. So we're, we're going to wait for something really good before we pop that in there. And we may even liquid cool this one with the used stuff that we have. And you know. So we can make a kick-ass one because we've got some good, I want to say we have a really good uh, GPU as well. And it's SLI, so we could go pretty hardcore if we can get another one of these used. Or just go SLI with something that's a 1080 Ti. I don't know if it works that way, but it might. But then going like that, it probably doesn't work. But it would be interesting to get like a really powerful one of these going. With the three-piece cool stream on it and whatnot. Okay, that's done. And really quick, I want to check something. Because I think... I'm not going to bother. 
I think the three piece would fit in there because we've done it before, so it must fit. All right, this one is done. Just in case. We, yeah, we're not going to level off of this probably. No, not quite. So close though. All right, let's power down, make it a brand new day. Find a new oot song for your brand new day, you fuck. Ooh. Ooh. It must be my birthday. Power up. Let's take a look. Let's boot you up. Because hopefully it's something simple. No CPU found. Well, what are you running, buddy? Well, this is bust. That's a nice processor, too. But you know what we just picked up? <laughs> uh, we could put this in there. It's not as good. We need to figure out what else is in here. That thing right there is hot. But let's take it out for a second. Take a look at what we're dealing with here. Oh, wait a minute. This is the repair one. Never mind. This is not this is not uh one of those ones that we can do. Oh crap. What was it? It was a 270X, wasn't it? And I sold that thing too. God damn it. Um Which one was it? What's the budget? We'll know with that. Oh, 500 bucks. Okay, let's. I assume it was this. I done goofed, y'all. I done goofed. Well, we know that it that it's going to be at least that. Could be a ra bad ramp stick too. We'll figure it out. They they've actually been give, been pretty generous. Um, about giving us a little bit more money than we need, but sometimes they don't, and there's nothing holding them to that either. Let's see here. It's like, ooh, a nice video card. Mine, 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 mine. Okay, so, so far, so good. We need to diagnose it, amongst other things. Ooh, I was talking about this earlier. Boom. Uh, why not? We need RAM in general, so. Two days left on that guy. These are kind of coming along. Fix, new PC, don't know. Probably repair. So, we don't need that anymore. Fix needed. <clears throat> he wants expensive stuff too. This looks like an upgrade. Could be a build. It's hard to say. But we'll figure it out. We'll diagnose, like I said, we'll diagnose this guy and then figure out what we're going to do. But we do have a Ryzen and an Intel, so that's good to know. Uh, well, it's riddled with prawn, that's for sure. All right, so that, that guy's good. Let's take a look here. Once again, Sector 72 is in need of your skill. Enemy activity is temporarily taken over the sector's parallel processing units offline out of redacted total units. There are currently a total of one still functional. <clears throat> this loss pro of processing power is having a del deleterious effect to systems across the sector, she, such as automatic doors opening too late, resulting in workers being un unacceptably delayed, or closing too soon, result of workers being unacceptably terminated. <laughs> Jeez. Other systems are also affected in the food area. The worker food supply terminal experience highly high latency while dispensing a jumbo sized strawberry milkshake. To compensate for the several seconds of delay, it dispenses the entire amount in one blast. This results in rapid disassembly of the worker and the stage four biohazard in cafeteria three. While we work to restore the damage processing units, you must upgrade the remaining unit to minimize disruption. Benchmark score of 10,000 will be satisfactory. Benchmark score less than 10,000 will be unsatisfactory. Unsatisfactory performance is grounds for termination. In other words, they'll kill me. All right, so. 
Um, twenty five hundred bucks, and he needs a lot. The AB three fifty gaming is a concern, though. Um. That's not 35,000. That's why it's 300. And Damn you. Damn you twice. It's a crossfire. I don't think any of the top video cards actually do crossfire. They're all SLI, I think. Well, this actually, this one does right here. So. <laughs> 750M. Uh, processor's okay. The RAM is garbage. If we did two of these, what are we talking about here? 1680 plus another 100 for the power supply. 1780. And th yeah, we could do it. We could replace this RAM out with some better stuff for this because this only takes 3200. So, yeah, we can do that. We can do that pretty easily. Literally by buying two of those. What was the 3200 here? Uh, well, hold on. Let's go to power supplies first. That's 100. And then now we want memory at 3200. the cheapest 16 gigs we can get it was like 210 so so we can get three of those and that's it we don't need to upgrade anything else I don't think we just need I just don't know about this motherboard though AB350 Multi GPU not a usable. Okay, so we need uh, we need to take one of those RAM sticks off, but that's not a problem. We should have the money to fix it, but we got to remove a RAM stick, and we need to go with an AM4 motherboard that's cheap, that can do multi card, and we hopefully Crossfire since we already got it in the cart. Um, this guy can do it at thirty two hundred as well. Um, so, bam. No, and, and then if we add another RAM stick, it's too much. Okay, so there's that one. That one's done. Can you help me out with something that's embarrassing, but can you... I need something to repair. Can you figure out what's wrong with it? It just keeps freezing whenever I try to do anything. Is that a reasonable deadline? AMD components are meant to be the bomb. I was on PC Bay the other day. I saw some red... E Plastic red, yellow, black cables. I know we don't have that. Red, yellow, black cables. What's the difference? Ribbon, ribbon. They're, they're both the same. Oh, red, yellow, black. Wait, does he? what does he want? Red, yellow, black. That's just red, yellow. We need to get rid of both of these and look again. <laughs> He wants red, yellow, black. Cables, red, yellow, black. Okay, so what does he, he want? Diagnose and fix. We don't know what's wrong, and we need to spend 200 bucks, so we'll just accept it. Need a new PC, please. Hi, someone recommended you for a new PC build. I'm looking to overclock in the future. Can you please put a custom water cooling loop in terms of time by tomorrow? But there is EKWB, and his PC says they're the best. Don't try to pass them any use parts. I want all new stuff. We accept. So we need to do this a little more thoughtfully this time around. Two hundred thousand seven hundred and fifty bucks is our budget. I believe minus three hundred for the one thing that we already have. So I gotta check it and make sure it's the right brand. But I think we have it. It is not the right brand, so never mind. We will buy something else. Um, case. Uh, so the case 
is going to be this Antec for 60. Power supply, obviously the 1300. We'll also go with the Patriot since that seems to be pretty consistent with good performance. I've been happy with it. VO card will come back for when we can. And now we just kind of got to do the other stuff here. So they didn't say there's no performance requirement. So again, we'll go with Coffee Lake. And we'll go with something that has a K on the end, just so we can say we, we it's a, uh, you can power it better. So boom, minus 195. Motherboard. Boom. Minus 155. And that's 4,000 megahertz on the processor. One, two, three, four. I think we can get four actually out of this. Well, maybe not. Minus 1,080. Yeah, we're going to back that down. Two, two. So minus 540. That's half of that. Okay, yeah, that's they got a little out of hand. Okay, so now we need to go to liquid cooling. So let's go with the GPU foist. Now they don't specify what to put in there, so we're going to just put whatever's affordable. Which, in my opinion, is going to be this guy. Boom. Minus 650. CPU block. Oh, wait a minute. E W what's the What's the name of that company? E K W Okay, it's still for six fifty, so that's fine. We need a regular CPU block. Minus three hundred, a reservoir, boom. Minus 220. And then we have 420 left. Let's go with a big radiator because I want to see if it'll fit. Boom. Minus 300. Okay, we'll buy that now. But before we do that, yeah, th that's all that it is, right? Yeah, so. Buy now. You should be done, good sir. And we'll get the cabling set up for what's coming up. Power down. Only one of these is a build, so... Boom. Now, really quick, um... All right. And we leveled up. We'll look at that in a minute. Start with this. Yeah, so this is the case of wonders. As we can fit what we kind of want, I think. As far as this thing goes. But I don't know about the radi uh, the other thing. So we got to figure that out. Reservoir. Oh, no, it does fit. It's a weird squeeze. So we'll have to figure out the rest of that. But it is what it is. And it's good to know that, though. Or we got to go with a twofer and then run it that way. But I don't see why we can't get that in there. We're going to try. Oh, 
Oh yeah, we're not doing that yet. Memory, the biggins. got to figure this monstrosity out. And strangely enough, we did. Missing parts. What parts? Oh, no boot device. Swear we put one on there. Yeah, whatever. Let that run. Not much to look at, I guess. I was just sitting there responding to a work text because there's not much to look at. There's not much to do. So much to do, so much to see. But I really kind of want to wait until we get two really, really awesome graphics cards that we don't have to buy. And then we'll build this guy for sure. As far as this one goes, it's still a good rig altogether. I just want to look for something that's a little bit that at least dual car. I want to be able to at least moderately dual card it. These two guys will be for cheapo machines. Um, and we have another cheapo one coming in. Same with this guy too. So we're going to try to get them in some cheap machines. Since we, well, this one has crossfire. So we'll sit on that one actually. It's so these two I want to get rid of. And even this one, if we can get it dual card, all the better. But, and we still have a really terrible rig coming. Uh, card i think that's gonna be available all right so this one is done i don't think there's anything else we could add or do to it to improve it so let's get it out there let's make a save just in case they try to screw us and we'll look at our level up stuff you guys have been patient enough may as well collect we get unlocked the intel skylake x processor t processor sweet what does that mean the i7-7800X, 7820, a whole bunch of neat other stuff, and a pattern cable pack. Next level up, UV coolant, a new set of video cards, and some higher, higher RAM. So we kind of want to look at these new Skylakes. I'm actually really curious. Um, because they're going to be beasts. Probably. Okay, it doesn't show it. What was the name of it then? So let's just get rid of that as our search. So what are these new processors? Is this it? Is the architecture? No, it just says it's different. But it's definitely stronger than 
the ones we've been using. The slot is still the same, so there shouldn't probably be any new motherboards. Yeah, not really. So I, I'm just... A, oh, here's the 4200 one. That's weird. It's the most expensive one. But it has the worst RAM speed for some reason. Whatever. Okay, so we, we have some stronger Intels. Though I think the strongest one is still a Threadripper. No, it's not necessarily true, but we'll look at it. We'll look at it when we actually start working with them. Right now, we're not really working with them, so there's no point in pondering. Ooh, okay. A case. A really tiny, shitty one. Okay. This is the dude with the upgrade. This is the dude. We've got a diagnose. <laughs> no CPU found. 1300X. So let's power this up. So... That's working. That's a case. That's broken. It's actually got some good stuff in it. We'll take it. Ooh, another broken one. We'll take it. One more day on the ones that are in the sh uh, that are on the shelf right now. So that's good to see. Project Neptune, new rig in the market for a new PC. Can you build me a PC? Okay, we did, that's nothing. So. Three new builds. Nice. Um, did I not take this out? Okay, there we go. Add to cart. Okay. So these are all builds that we need to deal with. Um, hi, I'm Martin Ventrix. Entrepreneur for Subworks GmbH. Subworks, as you may have heard from our press release last month, is a privately funded deep sea exploration venture. I founded the company to embark on an exciting voyage of discovery where every day, pres where every day presents new opportunities to learn more about the world around us. The Neptune Mark I will be a comprehensively equipped deep sea submersible with a crew complement of 12 and the ability to stand underwater for up to six months at a time. Propulsion will be provided by two link jet. Two link cam jolt 402 engines powered by the enrichment uranium reactor with a total output of. Well, I'll send you a link to the full technical documentation later. It's really fascinating stuff. Anyway, I wanted to get in touch with you because we'll no doubt be needing computer systems for the Neptune. Your company seems to have a good reputation, so expect some of work orders to come your way as soon as we finalize our plans. All the best, Martin Ventrix Subworks, whatever. Okay, well, when it comes, it comes. This will be fun. They gave us a fun one. Um, so, I don't know. We'll have to figure out what dual cards we want to put in there, but... It'll be, it'll be good stuff. Forty five hundred. Three thousand. Another kind of fun one as well when you think about it. And a less fun one, but because it's water cooled. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Let's let's get this going here. New rig we accept. I need a new PC. I'm pretty sure I'm a pretty hardcore gamer, so I need it to benchmark eleven nine nineteen. I have to have it in 12 days. Can you put two of the same GPU in, please? I'm a total Intel fanboy. Don't try to pass on any of these parts. I want all new stuff. Okay, we accept. And the budget is 4500 son. So, for 4500 sir, I can give you the world. So, processor-wise, we're going to go with one of the new ones here. 700 bucks. 
minus 700. CPU cooling. He doesn't care, so $10. We'll change that out as needed. Motherboard. Uh, whatever gives us the best RAM speed is what I care about. So... Is U minus 300. Okay, and the memory speed is 4133. So memory... We can put in eight of these things. <laughs> minus 1280... 2210 graphics cards. He doesn't care, right? Put in two of the same GPU, please. Now, we're not going to put in the biggest one at the bottom. We're not going to put in these two. They don't we want to go with 11 gigabytes for now and or 16 gigs. Um one of the two of those would be fine. We have one that's 16 gig, but it's a wattage hog. And as much as I'd like to go with that, I worry that the performance would be bad. But let's look at our performance really quick. Well, or we go with the TI Extreme Edition for raw performance. So, you know, we haven't tried them yet, I don't think. We're only 250 watts each. So we'll go with two of these. How much is that? 1,820. So minus 1,820. 390 is all we got left. So storage. We'll come back to that. Well, it's minus 100 for the power supply. And let's say minus 60 for the case. So power supply will be the 1,300. Wait a minute, do I have... Oh, 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 that's for another computer case. Boom. Which leaves us $230 for storage. What can I get for $230? You yeah, know, we'll take that. Boom. Minus 160. That should be fine. Nobody needs more than that. So wait a minute, what does that put us at? Why does that number not look right? Is there something in there that's not supposed to be in there? Wait a minute, wait a minute. I did math wrong somewhere. Why does that not come out right? Our budget is 4500 bucks. Oh, that's why. That's why. 150 right there. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Thought I fucked up. All right, now we have a new budget. 3,000. Uh, Same kind of dude. I'd like it done in four days. Dual GPUs. AMD. He wants AMD. Okay, so at 3,000 bucks... We'll do a try out a Threadripper again. So we'll go big with this guy. So boom, minus 800. For the cooling, we need the TR4. There we go. Boom, minus 58. We need the TR4. Still can't get past that 3600 speed, can we? Uh, let's go with SATX. So, boom. Minus 380. Memory is 3600. I don't think there are 16 gigs in this. So, let's, let's go... Nope, not in that. There we go. Uh, 
How much are those? Minus 544. Puts us at 1218. Graphics cards. Wait a minute. That's not going to work. If we want dual cards to hit that, yeah, that's not going to work. Okay, we can't go with the thread ripper. It's too too expensive to run. Is it well, maybe not that thread ripper. Is there a cheaper one? Yeah, there's cheaper ones. Maybe we'll go with the one that's $300, $250 less. Let's do that. So, let's add back in 250 bucks. 1468. It's still hurting to get 12 131. We take that out. This is a seventeen forty. Well, what's the cost on this? Two of those. Sixteen eighty. Which leaves us with 60 bucks. Hmm. So. Crap baskets. I mean, we could do it. But we need to cut back pretty heavily. Because we don't have storage or a power supply. So we need at least 120 bucks. Because I'll buy cheap ass storage if it means getting that, getting all of this the way I want it. So let's let's go cheaper on the RAM. Let's look at memory at thirty six hundred. Two of those would be two forty. Let's do one. Minus one twenty. Storage twenty. Power supply minus 100. We have to go with the big one. That's not an option. And we have 92 to spend on a case. Whoa. But we did it. So that's important. We were able to do that. We came, we saw, we conquered. Okay, one more rig to build out for. $2,500. Uh, I'm in the market for BC. Let's go big on a custom cool set. Do you think you do it in 12 days? I worry about used parts. I read that EKWB parts are really good. So it's another one of these jack holes. So he's just going to get what I feel like giving him. Um, as far as I'm concerned. So we'll go with like the usual coffee lake setup. So boom. Minus 170 with an appropriate motherboard that I agree with. Um, the memory on this can be 4,000, so we'll just put in two sticks of 4,000 something. So, boom, boom, minus 280. Uh, he wants a graphics card, so we'll do that when we get there. Scorch. Minus 110. Power supply, 1,300. Minus 100. Then the case, we'll go with the big one. Boom. Minus 60. All right, so this is all done for right now. So let's go ahead and order all of this stuff. Then we got to buy the liquid cooled stuff. Eight grand. And then the liquid cooling shop. So the brand is what? EKWB. Uh, boom. We'll just go cheap on this one. I don't care. Boom. Minus 220. Actually it works out going cheap because we don't have much of a choice. That's 360 for that one. 300. And then we have 975 bucks to burn. So we'll go with something a little better. We'll give him maybe this this guy. I don't know. 
We can go with one of these. Is there a TI? 955. Yeah, we'll give him the TI. Boom. Minus 955. That should be more than enough. And it's the right brand because some of these are not. They're FC, Actail, or Plexi. So this is the good one. So it should have this same day shipped as well. And you know what? We're going to have a long episode because I just want to get this done really quick. So who is this? This is L Ranger, Lone Ranger. I was going to get that. So what did you need? Who are you? You are top secret. So we need to take this out. And take these out. Because we got you a nice big rig. And you're going to need a better power supply too, buddy. I think we got them the full mo the full shtick here. So power supply is one of the 1300s. Memory was, I believe, these guys. And he had these two beasts. Set the RAM. And you needed the new CPU. Cooling. I think this was his. Actually, it could have been this. Virus scan and the other one as well. All right, let's go ahead and put on this. Boom, and this. We're going to need that. I don't care about his RAM. Fuck this guy. Eh, I do. Didn't need it anyway. On the scan, prone free GPU tuner, crank it. Should get the number he wants. Oops. This guy wanted the liquid cool system. So let's get to it. Open says me. So he can upgrade it or overclock it as he chooses. Because the guy's such a jackass. Could put in those Martonis only if they weren't used. All right, get all this on. Hundred and twenty bucks remaining. Something's missing. When I'm not quite sure. Oh, the power supply. <laughs> like something's missing, and I'm not quite sure. Oh, that's what's missing. You know, you know things need power, bra. And put in 
some coolant. Let's put this back together. And we'll make the setting good. And that guy will be done once we get it tested. Oh, crap. I just realized something. What's the guy that wanted the funny cables? Yes. So we got to redo his rig anyway. Let's get this going. Let's get this started first. Disconnect everything from everything. Okay, nothing connected there, there, or there. Got to run it again. You're done. You made it over 10,000. Good for you. Good for you, buddy. What makes me worry about the other one? Oh, wait. He doesn't have really good stuff in his machine, though. He's got a moderate, mediocre processor and just enough RAM to do the job. Power down. Now, that's why it's not, like, the greatest 10,000 ever. Okay. Who was this guy? You are the weird one that I put the weird stuff in. Who are you, Dickens? Get you in. Make some room. You're the one with the rise, and that's what it is. You psycho. You psychotic bastard! Yeah, you're only getting one stick, I think, bud. We'll see how that works. If worst case is we can't go with the Ryzen, we gotta go with something that's not that's not the Ryzen, or we gotta go with something that's not the thread ripper, because obviously it's ripping ass if at that point. Really, game. We should be able to do it with everything that's in this. Every little thing we can juice out of this. Every bit of performance we can milk out of that. Okay, this one's done. The other reason I want this episode going long is I really want to build that big machine now. Oh, shoot. Forgot my boot device, which actually goes on the back. Because it be a piece of crap. This one's done. That one's done. Okay, now this is the beast we want to make. The one I'm a little more excited about. Oh, 
Well, we have a rig we can build, too, I think, that we're sitting on a motherboard for. Okay. You need definitely need that. Should be able to get 1200 out of this. Processor is really good. Might have to turn that wattage down though, a little, just a little bit. May have gone a little overboard with that. And the cheapest part, the protection. I don't think we have anything else we can put in there that's extra, that's new, that's sitting around. Nope. I don't have that little, I don't have a little motherboard. I want this out of my shop. We'll compare it with something terrible. Because we have it. Hmm. Put that in there since it's so large. This case already. As much as I want to use that, I want to save that for when we really need it. Another heap will be out of here as well. Okay. Oh. Let's try it again. You know what? Since it's so shitty, let's boost the fuck out of it. May as well. We gotta turn this down a little, just a little bit more. Nice. Nice. Try it at about there. Anything we can, oops, anything we can get, do to get better performance out of this thing will help it in the long run. It's only worth 432 bucks. I'm going to close this back up. I'm pretty sure we'll meet that number. Blue screen. We just gotta get the. We gotta t dial in the the tuner. That one's finishing, so that looks like we did good on tuning that, dialing that back.
1508. Nice. Yeah, the Ram did nothing for this. Which is fine. We got the performance we wanted. And that's what's important. down to the hallway <laughs> those uh, we've seen lower but that was way in the beginning of the game that's for sure power down 444 bucks well well so we're only gonna make like two hundred dollars off that thing because all the parts that are in there except and so we're probably only make 150 bucks or so, but I want it out. I don't want to look at it. It's embarrassing. Its existence saddens me. Everything's ready to go except for this one. Ooh. It's not the best score possible, but it's we're getting higher every every minute down and this guy is done nothing's missing right yeah all right we'll turn these in but we'll save first if there's an issue we'll have to clear it up next episode but look at that guys we did great okay let's go ahead and collect on these nice so a chiller the ultimate one Nice. Nice. Another thingy like that. And nice. So look at that. And there's nothing left to work on. All right. So this is a good place to stop. So thank you guys for enduring this longer episode. I'm your host, your RPG Guy. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Check out my Twitch channel at twitch.tv slash Studios for more live gaming action. Check out our Chairman of the Board show on that same channel as well to watch live tabletop gaming. And check out our blind playthrough with Hobo Headcrab as he plays games that are of ancient times. And he is not an ancient person. He's, his reactions are the best. And you don't want to miss out on that. And you get to see us live. Because, yeah, I'm there too. So anyway, thanks for stopping by, guys. We'll see you guys next time.